Royals. We about to get some work in. <sighs> about to head to the gym. Yes, yes. Um, I'm looking at the screen right now on this camera. Got a new camera, Royal. So definitely want to, uh, you know, start to get you guys the quality that I said we definitely going to work towards. So today I got something, a new series I kind of want to start. Show you guys, you know, workout sessions, uh, the, the kicks I wear during my sessions and um kind of give you guys a little bit of feedback a lot of the benefits i feel from the shoes and pitfalls all of that but i need to prepare first for the gym so i need to get my kit together let's do it <laughs> so of course we got our water muscle milk for those who follow me on uh snapchat you might see me sipping on this quite a bit i also um, was drinking this on one of my recent vlogs I did. So muscle milk I really like because I don't really have to mix anything together, put it in a blender, take the time to do that. Super quick, you get a good amount of, um, if this focus, get a good amount of protein. It's just a good morning, quick morning uh, supplement that I take in terms of food replacement. And then my multivitamin, I definitely try to keep this. Uh, this is... Women's Ultra Makeup from GNC. Uh, it has a lot of things that I've been kind of deficient on. Uh, vitamin D, magnesium, potassium, things like that. Uh, so it it has helped me with quite a few pitfalls I was having physically after workouts. And then this is one of the supplements I use. If it'll focus. Let's see. There we go. Lean Fire XT by Force Factor. So um, this is actually a fat burner that I use uh, just because my efforts are not to lose weight, but to just, you know, get lean, um, be able to see the benefits of a lot of the work I put in when I get these gains, Royals. So folks want to know if this works. Uh, for me, this definitely works. So this is the kit, baby. This is the kit. <laughs> Let's uh let's let's pack these up and then I'll show you guys what I'm wearing today to the session. Okay, Royals. So today, this is a long, long awaited dang my little wristlet is in the way on the camera. Learning curves, Royals. <laughs> long, long awaited um vid I've been wanting to do because y'all know I unboxed these on a previous vid. So these are the Adidas Alpha Bounce. So we rocking these to the gym today. Um, and like I said, I was, I'll, I've had plenty of time at this point, a, a few months now, uh, to kind of give you guys what I've been, what my thoughts are on these. I think it's definitely an efficient amount of time to have at least an accurate um, sort of pulse use review <laughs> so yeah let's let's put these on and, and head on out okay all right go and see this I usually uh, usually walk to the gym just because it's that close to where I live but driving a day because I have some errands to run after the session so we about to head into the Jeep get us a nice little sweat in a nice little gains gains Chronicles <laughs> To get my muscle milk on, baby, baby. Let's turn the pharaoh, nigga. All I do is flex. I could never stress. I finesse. Smoke the best weed. Like it got to rest. I can't rest. I confess I'm out of weight, nigga. How many souls we gon' take with us? How many shots we gon' take, niggas, from that blue pride? I took a look inside and I seen fear. I'm the leader here, the revolutionary, and I'ma make it clear. Mama ain't raised no slave. Flex side to my grave. Why they think I play games? I don't work the arcade, no. I just got an insane flow. I'ma stay in my lane, no. I don't really want pain. All right, 
Royals. So I'm back in the Jeep, got a little bit of work in. If you notice, I did, you saw me doing upper body, lower body. This was kind of a combo day. I didn't have like a concentration of upper and lower. Um, typically throughout the week, I'll, you know, I'll do, you know, uh, biceps, triceps, shoulder day, a leg day, this, that, and third, and then I'll choose one day out of the week to do a combo day. So today was that. Um, but yeah, so going into the alpha bounce, um, and let me grab one of these off my feet, a post-workout alpha bounce. <laughs> um, so with these, as you all know, or if you don't know, basically it has a mesh upper. Um, and so with that mesh upper, it allows for a lot of flexibility, allows for a lot of freedom. It all, almost makes you feel like you have on a sock um, when you're working out. Now, what kind of contrast that is obviously the outsole. So this is the bounce technology. Um, one of the reasons why I want to try this shoe is because I remember when bounce technology like was a new phenomenon like in the late 2000s when it was like super obnoxious on the shoe but now it's like very inconspicuous it's kind of just integrated with the outsole now so you get a lot of responsiveness with the bounce um so when you're doing things like you know jump roping or just anything that where you need some form of um impact control depending on your movement um this kind of allows for that so you do get that with these it's not overly responsive but you definitely feel like you know there is some form of a bounce that whole bounce technology is a thing with these so it's it's genuine um now one of the things with them being so free flowing with the mesh upper is that it doesn't allow for a lot of stability and that's kind of the downside to these. So if you're doing something like lunges or anything like that where you need maybe more of a uh, more of a coverage for the toe cap and varying things like that, you don't really have that. Um, for me, when I'm deficient with magnesium, potassium and things like that, oftentimes in these shoes, I do find that my foot does cramp up sometimes. If you don't have that issue, that deficiency, you won't probably experience that. But for somebody like me, I need a shoe when I'm training that has more stability. So it could have more of a caging on the sides, you know, for my arches, more of a toe cap, things like that, that gives me some more stability. Um, but again, when I'm just doing just like a regular, you know, weight training, not a whole lot more, um, this, this should suffice. You know, this is a good shoe. This is a good walking shoe for sure. If you're running, this is not necessarily a running shoe. You could probably do three to five miles for hardcore runners, maybe even 10, but this is not really an ideal running, running shoe like a hardcore runner's shoe at all but you can get some things done with it um but yeah it is a good shoe so i'm not saying what i'm saying to say you know don't buy the alpha balance you can get some things done it is super comfortable so don't take that for for um as a grain of salt so comfort flexibility responsiveness is a good it's a it's on a good scale um but again stability is the biggest downside with this shoe royal so think about that and that's kind of my uh post-workout review <laughs> on the, uh, the alpha bounce so you guys got my little uh first installment of kind of my workout rotation series i haven't figured out what i'm gonna call it yet but progressively you know as i get better tripods you know get get a get a hang of how to use this camera a little bit more and even upgrade cameras um we'll start to be able to get a little bit better in terms of the quality of these so i'm excited about it it's something different a lot of people aren't doing this um lifestyle health all of that is a part of my life so um it's not just about just being fresh and just going to the mall you know i go to the gym you know three to four to five times a week so that's a part of my life royal so um i like to include you guys